Back road to Barkerville. Four Caribou Gold Rush Ghost Towns. I set out from Williams Lake to find the old Caribou Gold Rush town of Quinell Forks, which sits at the confluence of the Caribou and the Quinell Rivers, and has a wreck site right beside it. But the weather did not cooperate. So I headed back to Likely and stayed at the lodge there. Okay. The weather situation has improved. Twenty, and I'm all loaded up leaving Likely Lodge, which was a real find. Really friendly staff, good food, comfortable if quirky rooms. Yeah. I'm gonna try and get around to Barkerville, the back road route. Some concern about mud again, because it's apparently it's been raining up here for three weeks. And uh, one of the locals says the bridge not too far up is uh, pretty slick when it's raining. We'll see. Yeah, this is a highway, this thing. So that's Kelly Creek that way. This one will take us to Barkerville. Washout at Four, five, five. Hmm. The bike is feeling way better. Like, way better. Not drifting around. And that's because fuel's gone, and I've moved this from way up here down here. So now it's like a little backrest, and that's quite a bit of weight, this thing, and it was way too high. So it's only taken me five days to figure that out. But yeah, the bike feels pretty much normal now. This is called Ladies Creek Rec Site. Sweet. threw on the raincoat and the winter gloves because I'm booting along at such a good speed. It's kind of cold. It's pretty uh, zoned out there. All of a sudden we got Muddy and rutty. Not a lot of mud, but so we uh, got the speed. More forest fire burn. I just passed uh, the first vehicle I've seen in like an hour. Uh, company truck. And I flagged the guy down and asked him about the washout and he said they were supposed to be replacing a pipe, but he said you can get by. So that is good. Snow here. Cafe closed. Too bad.
Yeah, how are you? But I can go through. Cool. Thanks. What's that? Yeah. This is a nice drive. <laughs> They got this kind of cut up, but it's okay. down to 1,015 meters and dropping fast because it was cold up there at the peak. The sad little Comet Creek Resort. Totally deserted. Kind of cute. say about a two-thirds of the way there. I think I just came through that rain shower. I seem to have gotten off the track here. It said bypass. Okay, that's cool. Now this bypass certainly is a bypass. It went way off the track and very high, 1,344 meters and there's snow again.
thoroughly enjoyed Parkerville. Wells. It was a very nice lunch and I had a great conversation with a family from the Netherlands who have driven up from Vancouver, well they took the ferry up to uh, Prince Rupert and now they're driving all the way to Jasper, Banff and then back to uh, Vancouver. So that was kind of cool. Stanley Road. Go see another ghost town, if there's anything left of it. Apparently this place used to have more people in it than Barkerville. Not much left now. Well, there is a little bit of Stanley left, and it's the Stanley Cemetery. You never know what you're getting when you wander into these places. This is Cottonwood House. Fraser, once again, still huge all the way up here. called Twin Lakes Rec Site. Looks like a win to me. This'll do. I can hear people going by on the, on the main road, but none of them are stopping. There's nobody else here again. 